Hi Douglas Fur. How's everyone doing today? I want to talk a little bit more about things that are happening in spring. We talked about how a seed sprouts, the parts of the seed and how plants start to grow. And one of the parts of the plants I want to talk about today is, can you guess from what's behind me? Flowers! Yeah, what are the parts of the flowers? So I went on a walk just down my alleyway and collected some of the wildflowers that were growing along the sides and also have some little tulips. Let's go and explore and see what are the parts of the flower. Come on. Look at all the flowers. Most plants have flowers. Flowers help plants make seeds or reproduce. Seeds are how most plants grow. Flowers can be many colors and many shapes and sizes. Some are huge and some are so small and tiny. What flowers have you seen growing around your neighborhood? Here are the parts of the flower. The flower has a calyx. The calyx is the part that covers and protects the bud of the flower before it blooms. You can find it at the base of the flower after it blooms. The flower has a corolla. All the petals together are called the corolla. Flower has stamen. Stamen are where the pollen is. Flower has a pistil. The base of the pistil is where the new seeds can grow. Those are the parts of the flower. Let's review with the three part cards. The whole flower, the calyx, Corolla, stamen, and pistol. Let's see if you can remember the names. What is this part? Yes, the corolla. What about this? The pistol. And the stamen. The whole flower. And yes, the calyx. You named all the parts of the flower. Now let's try with a real flower. I have a rhododendron here. You see all the parts of the flower? Hmm, let's see. I'm gonna try to get the calyx off here first. Carefully trying to tear it without breaking into the other parts. Did it, there's a calyx. Now let's see, what else can we get? Oh, I think I see the pistil in there. It looks different than the rest of the stamen. Now we have all the stamen and the corolla. Let's see if we can get those. Let's see if I can get all the stamen out here together. Got a little bit of pollen on my fingers. I got most of them. There are the other ones. Okay, we got all the stamen and now we have the corolla. Look, this corolla, all the petals are together. Okay, now we're ready to tape the parts of the flower to the card. I'll start with the calyx. Let's tape that part down. Okay, then you can tape down all the other parts of the flowers as well. And then you're ready to label. There we go. We made a parts of the flower card. I wonder what flowers you'll find around your yard or in your neighborhood that you could make a card or a book with. Or maybe you want to color the page, 
Whispers from the three-part cards to make a book. Have fun!